Hello, my name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do the top 10 fall lippies and a bonus too. So if you'd like to see what these top 10 lippies do, please stay tuned. And let's get started. We're going to jump in with NYX Liquid Suede and this color is in Orange County. Talk about a pop of orange. At first, you may be a little scared and concerned as far as how bright that it, this is, but look at how nice it goes on. And with this bright color, it just changes the look of my makeup and to me looks very stunning. So I will say I was scared to put this one on, but when I did, I fell in love with this color. We're going to stay with our top two lit or top 10 list with NYX Liquid Suede, and this color is called Soft Spoken. This is a cream lipstick, and cream it is. It goes on so nice. The formula is wonderful, and I really enjoy this. And as you can see, this is a beautiful mauve type color. It just looks soft and gorgeous and is a great pick for fall. Going a little more on the high end side, we're going to pick Dolce K from the Kylie Lip Collection. So I wanted to show this color back to back with the NYX Liquid Suede in Soft Spoken to give you kind of a, a comparison of two mauve lipsticks. This one from Kylie is in her Metal Matte Lipstick Collection. It is beautiful. It goes on very nice and smooth. And as you can see, it looks very similar to the NYX. Love this color also. Staying in Kylie's corner and using a bit of an orangish, we have number 22. So this one is my top pick from Kylie. As far as having an orangish brick red color, it is a nice fiery orange that is more muted than the NYX in Orange County. So if Orange County was too bright for you, this Kylie lipstick it number 22 would probably be a better fit for you. It is a nice orangish color. It is a good formula and as you can see with all of these lippies I did not need a lip liner or a lip pencil. All of the lipsticks I chose today are really good. You just can use them on their own. And speaking of the orangish type brick collection, we have Kai from ColourPop. ColourPop is probably one of my favorite lipsticks to wear. They wear throughout the day. I don't need to touch them up. This one is a lot darker than the Kylie number 22, but still has a orangish brown hue. So I wanted to put those back to back in this video so that you can see um, if the Kylie lipstick was not dark enough and you want a bit of a darker lip, this is where you're going to flip to the ColourPop Kai. Absolutely gorgeous. Staying in ColourPop's corner, my next favorite is Rouge. So this color is yummy. It's getting darker. It's elegant. It is very fall. So it is a brick, a darker brick reddish orange. It goes on nice and smooth. Once again, I've not used a lip liner because I haven't needed to with any of these lippies. I do like how this pop of dark color works with the color palette I have on the eyes. Just absolutely thrilled with 
the ColourPop company as a whole. Next, if you want to tone it down, we are going to use Urban Decay's Peyote, the metallized line. So this color goes, it's, it's more cream based and does not stay on all day. But if those darker colors were too much for you, this Urban Decay is great. This one can be mixed with a lip color or a lip pencil. So we're going to pop over to Backdoor by Urban Decay. And here we have another metallized version lipstick. This is another creamy one. And as with Peyote, these might need a, um, a lip liner to go with them. Because they're a little bit more creamy, they do shift and move and don't last all day. We are going to go to one of my other favorites, Kat Von D. So this is her Project Chimps Lippy, and this one is a orangish color. And oh my gosh, ladies, I've put this in another video, and I will tell you, obviously, if this is in another video, how much I love this color. So once again, I picked an orangish red color for the fall. Kat is amazing with her formula. I love how consistent it is, how wonderful, and talk about staying power. So we are going to go with Kat again, and this is with Exorcism. It is a dark color. It is going to be more on the berry side of the colors. And if this color is too dark for you, you are going to see me play with my bonus two colors with it. But let me tell you, Exorcism on its own is absolutely gorgeous. So this is really almost the only color in my that made the top ten list that has a berry um, base to it or a berry color. Berries don't do as well on my skin as far as my skin tone goes, but let me tell you, Kat's Exorcism, I thought looks great um, as far as being a nice berry color. So the two that made it in the top two list is by ColourPop. The colors are Lights Out and Three Way. These two lip colors are in the metallic lippies. So I'm going to show you how to put these two lippies on top of Exorcism and create a little bit of sparkle and shine. So on half my lip, I will use the lights out to show you what gold looks like on top of Exorcism. And then on the other half of the lip, I am going to take three-way and basically do the same thing. I will put three-way on the other half of the lip and you can see how these two ColourPop metallic lips will change a bit of the base color which in this case is Exorcism but it just gives your lip color some extra sparkle and shine and for the holidays who doesn't love some extra sparkle and shine? So I really liked how these two, coupled with Exorcism, ended up making the lip just really stand out and pop just a little bit more. If you want to see, here we have Lights Out. And I'm putting this one on just by itself so you can see the nice gold tone. This is a beautiful gold color, more with the yellow tints and glow in it. But this will give you an indication what Lights Out looks on its own, which I think is stunning. Then I'm going to show you what three-way looks like. So three-way on its own is a berry color again. And you will be able to see how this metallic line looks all on its own. Again, I'm just a huge ColourPop fan. 
I like the way that ColourPop glides on. I love the way that either the metallic line or their matte lip stays throughout the day. So I'm always pleased and so far, knock on wood, have not been let down by ColourPop as a whole. I think the company has done a jam up job. I want to say thank you all for watching. This has been a fun video, a little bit different than my norm. But I do appreciate you staying watching. And if you can, please feel free to subscribe or refer me to a friend. I thank you so much for your time today. And as always, make it a beautiful day.